Hello guys, Matthew here and welcome back again to the Tactic YouTube channel. Although Arctic brand is more known for their cooling solutions, they also have some good quality PC and mobile peripherals, one being this new gaming headset called P533 Racing. Right off the bat, let's clear something out. The racing look and name will not make you go faster and lap better in Forza Horizon 3, or that it will do anything better racing related compared to other gaming headsets. That's just marketing department doing its thing. The product box is rather standard looking, you can see a picture of the headset on the front, some talk about its main features on the back of the box, alongside of another picture of the headset, supported platforms, and of course technical specifications listed out on the side of the box. Opening up the box you can see that everything is neatly packed in this hard protective casing which is a great bonus if you plan to carry your headset a lot. In it for the bundle you'll find an extension cable, quick start guide and warranty information, some silica gel for jack from the unbox therapy. And finally the headset itself. The P533 indeed looks like it was pulled off from someone at Formula 1 pit box. Its shape and looks are very similar to that kind of design, with big ear cups on the outside, metal headband and construction, big microphone boom and so on. If you are not a fan of this racing look skin, you can also choose the military camo one. Speaking of the microphone, you can see here that we have a retractable and very adjustable construction, which has this cool open style design with wires being visible, even for the ear cups. Of course, the most important thing about it is not its design, but how well it sounds, and here's a sample of that. This raw audio recording was done using the microphone on the Arctic's P533 headset. Feel free to tell me how does it sound in the comment section below. Is it any good? I personally think it's actually pretty good. Moving back to the headset itself, comfort wise I would place them really high, they have a lot of soft padding on the top and the ear pads are also huge and comfortable, providing along the way a really good sound isolation as they cover up your whole ear and with just the right amount of lateral pressure. The only thing I didn't like about it is the fact that the headband isn't adjustable at all, for example you cannot expand it, you'll just get some ear cup wiggle room on one side while the other is completely fixed, fortunately they can both swivel from inside to out, so there is still some adjustment. Despite that, this model supports a really good build quality, although they could maybe ditch that glossy finish, but overall I was pleasantly surprised by it, but when I think about it, I usually am with their products, especially considering the price point. On the right ear cup you will find your volume control as this big wheel, which has a really good feel to it when turning. In terms of other controls, actually there isn't any, like additional inline buttons and microphone mute option. For connecting up the headset we have this 1.2 meter long red cable with a 4 pin 3.5 mm TTRS plug, so you can use this headset even on mobile devices together with the microphone, while otherwise for a standard PC connection with separate audio in and audio out jacks you will have to use this 2 meter long extension splitter cable. Audio quality wise, the 40mm drivers deliver very clean and detailed mids and highs, but the bass is pretty dull and underwhelming, definitely not as present as I would like it to be. For around $60 I would say that this is a pretty decent and well rounded deal, although I would really love to see some other pretty standard features for this segment, like that microphone mute feature and before all expandable headband, especially since competition is really tough at this price point. That's it guys for this time from me, thank you once again for checking out the unboxing and review of the Arctic's P533 gaming headset. Feel free to give this video a thumbs up if you like it, that helps me a lot, leave a comment down below if you have any questions about the product, and of course if you would like to see more content like this you can subscribe to the Tactic YouTube channel or you can just check out some of my other videos from before.